Kia ora te whanau. Today I want to talk to you about performance-based training and why you should focus on it when it comes to your training. Performance. Performance-based training or performance-focused training is just a method of training where you will focus more on improving your strength, improving your power or improving your physical ability. So instead of focusing on the areas that most people focus on, weight loss or physique, basically aesthetic parts of the results you get from training, you're gonna focus on the training itself and the physical benefits of getting stronger, getting more powerful or getting fitter. The first reason you wanna focus on performance-based training is mainly for that instant feedback. The great thing about training this way with a performance focus is that you will get quite fast results in comparison to focusing on things like your physique or aesthetic improvements. Performance. The reason that you'll get results much quicker is because you can make a simple change such as just the way you set up to affect your performance instantaneously. Performance. An example of this is someone who has never done actual squats before simply changing the way that they set themselves up the focus cues they should use during the movement they can actually improve their squat on the spot and just by doing that you'll see a performance improvement another example is if someone is using load instant feedback cues from a coach that is experienced in that field can change whether or not they are successful with a lift. I've seen many times where people are being trained for Olympic lifts, like the clean or the snatch, and with a few simple changes with their cues for those technical improvements, they are able to change the way that they do the lift and be successful immediately. Performance. Another reason performance-based training or performance-focused training is really helpful is that people can use it to set their goals because it is extremely objective in nature. Things that are subjective are like saying, I wanna be fitter, stronger, faster, something along those lines. The problem with this is all of those things are so broad in nature that it makes it difficult to try and pinpoint what faster looks like for you. So what we usually do is we make it objective. This basically means make it more measurable. So testing yourself to see how fast you are right now and then saying in the future, I wanna be this much faster than that point. Or if it's regards to your strength, testing your strength with something like a bench press. If I can lift 90 kgs on my bench press right now. Performance. My goal is to lift 100 kgs the next time that I do it. And now I need to fill in the steps required to get me 10 kgs stronger. And finally, one of the most important reasons that you want to use performance focused or based training is because it actually will give you the results that you want to see. When it comes to being a personal trainer or a coach and we try and tailor trainings for people based on the goals that they seek, we make those training sessions and the methods that we choose to use revolve around what kind of end goal it is that they want. So if it is someone that wants to improve their bench press and make themselves stronger, then we tailor the training sessions to suit that type of goal. By making sure that that person lifts enough times during the week, gets enough volume in with that type of lift, has enough recovery with that type of lift and does that lift a specific way, we can guarantee that over a period of time, they will get the adaptation necessary to help them get from 90 kgs to 100 kgs. And fortunately, this is the same with aesthetic goals. So if I want to get someone uh, smaller, help them to lose weight, if they're trying to get from 100 kgs down to 90 kgs, then we can use the same type of method to help them get down to that weight as well. First, we could start with some physical activity. We could get them moving more than they do already. We could change some of the things that they do to make them stronger and fitter. And then we could start looking at their nutrition as well. And we have to look at what they're doing, make some changes, get them at a deficit, and provide them with the necessary nutrition to help them reach that goal. So long story short, even if you're not aware that you're doing performance-based training or performance-focused training, 
If you have a coach or a trainer, they're probably giving you something along those lines anyway. And most of the good trainers and coaches out there will make you do stuff that is performance based and will try and sway you to focus more on that performance type training so that you understand that it's important for you to get stronger. It's important for you to get fitter because that's going to give you those aesthetic results that you desire. Performance. Yeah. Anyways guys, hopefully you got some better understanding of why performance training is so important to keep as your focus when you're performing your training sessions. Don't worry about the end results so much, just focus on the process. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please like, please subscribe, and please share. If you wanna check out more stuff like this, head over to our Instagram page. You can DM us there and ask any questions you have about what is performance-based training? How can I change my mindset so that I focus more on performance-based? Head over to at the collective training ask us all the questions on there if you made it this far into the video then you know what to do please drop that young sword down in the comments below thank you so much for your support team peace performance